Hello YouTube, uh, this is a video of the things I picked up from uh, Carbook today. Uh, I went to uh, Hemswell, uh, just past Gainsborough in uh, Lincolnshire. Uh, it was on today, Bank Holiday Monday. Uh, so yeah, I'll just run through the things that I've got. Uh, first thing, this guy had, uh, on the back of his van, he had this box that says Comics, 50p each. Uh, I, I mean, I didn't even see that. Uh, it was still on his van. And I said, uh, so I just said, how much are the comics? Cause I never saw the price. And he said, oh, uh, £5 for the whole box if you want. And so I just said, yeah. Uh, so I've got that. And I'll just run through what was in the box. Uh, we've got, well, they're all Marvel. And we've got X Factor. Nothing to do with the, uh, the TV show. Factor X. Spider-Man. An X Factor, uh, that one, oh, in fact, that Factor X is an issue one. That one, that's issue one, two, and three. I think that's a set. Uh, there's quite a few of those. X Men, that starts at issue four. That's the amazing X-Men. This one's the uncanny X-Men. Starting at issue 301. I'll put them in order. X-Man. X-Force. And there's still more. Excalibur. There's quite a few of those again. And... Uh, there's the last ever issue in there as well. Deadpool. This is issue one, the first collector's issue from 1997. Uh, I've had a quick look on eBay and apparently the only ones I can see, the cheapest one is £50. And some are going for like over £100, £180. So I think I might have done quite well on that one. But it all depends on condition, but it looks quite good. And there's a couple of other, a uh, couple of other dead pulls underneath as well. Uh, Black Panther, and that one is an issue one as well. I think that might be worth quite a bit. The New Mutants, and that's issue one, one of three. That one's Cable, and that's issue one as well. So I think I'm doing all right with these. Uh, anyway, on to other things. Picked up a book, Living Gluten Free for Dummies. That was a pound. And some old books, these were 50p each. Our Pets, and two Eenie Blyton books. Uh, I picked those up because A, they were cheap, and B, what I used to re read when I was about five or six, seven. Uh, that one's quite nice. It it pops up, so it's in very very good condition. Apart from that little tear, I think those uh, two birds must have got at that. Uh, so uh, yeah, quite a nice quite a nice book. Little uh, rhymes inside. Uh, right, a Doctor Who audio CD. I picked up one of these uh, the other day as well and this one's The Curse of Fenric. Uh, quite interesting though because it's got a, a swastika on the front of that so uh, maybe a bit controversial there. And the uh, the old uh, USSR symbol. So that's quite an interesting one. Uh, Teach Yourself Spanish BBC Audio Double CD. Uh, one of the discs is a bit scuffed, but I think it'll still work. The other one's mint, so obviously they only got so far on that course. Uh, some DVDs. Um, I picked these up because uh, A, I want to watch them, and B, yeah, they were, they were only cheap. And it, it was like if you pick up three, you get them for like £2 or they were a pound each. So anyway, I picked up the right stuff. Which is a really good film that one uh, about the early uh, space missions 
Star Trek Nemesis and Game of Thrones the complete first season uh, that one the one took one pound fifty for that uh, these are quite interesting that I got these from the same place where I got that gluten free for dummies uh, it was like a stall inside an aircraft hangar uh, on this car boat anyway and these are old audio data cartridges and they're all sealed uh, this one in its original uh, packaging and then a few of the different types Sony 3M Maxell uh, right I've got some some games now I've got PlayStation 2 Hit and Run always a good one to get uh, Worms 3D Ridge Racer Type 4 plus Ridge Racer High Spec Demo and I'll try and actually open it up and show you and there is the, the demo so it's definitely all in there not too bad that one uh, demo number one the original PlayStation a bit scuffed but uh, not too bad we've got some good games on there Abe's Odyssey Formula 197 uh, Porsche Challenge some other bits and bobs uh, this is a sealed Xbox 360 game Alan Wake psychological action thriller I've heard good things about that so I'm looking forward to playing that uh, and I am going to play it and I'll sell it after I've played it a uh, couple of lips uh, these games come with two microphones as well and these were five pound for all these in good condition uh, over here we've got a Scrabble good condition uh, apart from the, the cover is a bit scuffed uh, but everything else inside looks pretty good uh, even comes with a free pen always good to get an extra pen uh, last things I picked up I uh, got this Parker fountain pen that was £1.50 and then this was actually in with all that box of comics uh, to me it looks like a quite an old spoon so I don't know exactly how old it is there's no markings or anything on it but it uh, be interesting to know more about that uh, a bit tarnished, but yeah, not, not bad as an extra Brucey bonus. Uh, but anyway, that's what I picked up today. I uh, hope you've all had a good weekend and uh, enjoy the rest of your day.